And there are the final two. Ten box case. There they are. I'm gonna try and get more. These are really cool. Yeah, I'll look and see if I can grab some more. Probably over the weekend, all of them. I don't think my guy has them, but it doesn't mean I can't get them. All right, pen. Here it is. Okay, where are we? I gotta reboot here. So the random was done. It looks like Sean Wingler gets card number one. Uh, number two goes to Stephen Delmo. Number three goes to Stephen Delmo. Number four goes to Sean Wingler. Number five goes to Mike Kefalver. Number six goes to Stephen Delmo. Number seven, Stephen Delmo. Number eight, Stephen Delmo. Number nine, Kyle Kelleher. Number 10, Stephen Delmo. Number 11, Pedro Soto. And number 12, Stephen Delmo is how the random put him in place. That's what that second number is behind your initial number to the right of your name. <clears throat> so he just randomized the 12 spots and. That determines the order of what cards get pulled. That's so who gets what. All right, let me quick make sure I tag everybody to it. Sean Wingler. Welcome, Sean. How you doing? Kyle. Kill her. Yeah, I love this product. I'll be doing some a lot of uh, uh, what's coming out. Why does it always slip my name, my brain? Um, Undisputed's coming out soon. I'll be getting a bunch of that. Our Pedro's in it. We pulled some serious hits out of this last night. That was cool. I think that's it. It's just five of you. Yep. Ultimate Wrestling. Everything that I broke from the last couple nights is already gone. Alright, everybody's tagged. It's in it. And let me get the gloves on and we'll find out what we're going to get. Let's see. Okay. Gloves are on. Sleeves are out. Top loaders are out. Here we go. We'll go with left tonight. Alright, box number one. There it is, it's covered up. <laughs> Alright, so this is box one. There's the seal. There's the other seal. There we go. Okay, out they go. There's empty. Alright, we'll take that off, flip it, and bring it back. And there are the cards. We go from top to bottom. The top card is card number one. The bottom card is card number six. Then we open the next one. The top card will be number seven down through 12. And that's how we do it. So, here we go. First card is going to go to Sean Wingler, and he's going to pull a Kamala Red, numbered 8 out of 10. There you go. Starting us off with Kamala. I remember him. <laughs> All right. So, Sean, there you go. You got the first card. Number to 10 Red Parallel of Kamala. <clears throat> Hold on one sec. There you go. Did a big break before this. My voice is going. Oh, wow. Look at that one coming up. Here's Brutus Beefcake, number two. Going to Stephen Delmo. That's an orange parallel. Oh, 
Alright. Brutus Beefcake. I remember him. So Kamala number to 10. Brutus Beefcake's our second one. Orange parallel. One to Steven Delmo. Number three is going to be Steven as well. And this is a pretty sweet one. I like this. Bob Orton. There you go. Ultimate Enshrined. Sweet card there. This is some... I like this product. There's some serious autos in this. And that's an orange parallel. It's not numbered. Cowboy Bob Orton. There he is. Randy Orton's dad, right? And then we go to the fourth card. That's going to go to Sean Wingler. And you are going to get... The Barbarian, green, numbered five out of five. So you got two low-numbered hits. Kamala and the Barbarian. That'd probably be a pretty good tag team if you put them together. Five out of five. Oh, did he? That's a shame. So the Barbarian gets pulled. That's going to Sean as well. The fifth card... Is Mike Kefauver, and he's gonna get a Ring Queens Ryan Shamrock. There you go. That's pretty cool looking. That's an orange parallel. That's not numbered. And that's going to Mike Kefauver. That's a Ring Queen. And the six card's pretty awesome. That's going to Stephen Delmo. Brett the Hitman Hart. Five out of 25. Ultimate Enshrined Purple. Sweet. I think that's the second one I've pulled of him. Out of all the ones I've done so far. But that is a nice hit right there. Yeah, I would definitely be grading some of these. These are in great shape. And I'm not touched by human hands or anything. Boom. So that's box number one. I have them in order as I took them out. Put them right there. And I'll recap it then at the end. Now we go into box two. Final box of the case. This is the tenth box. There's the seal. There's the seal. What are we going to get? Because it's been crazy, all these different types of autos we're getting. There's empty. We did get a Hulk Hogan, Dennis Rodman the other night, dual auto. That was cool. It would be nice to get like a quad auto in the final one. What are we getting here? It looks like something weird in there. What, are we gonna, what is that? I guess we'll find out, won't we? So we're at card number seven now. That's the top one. And that's it's an awesome one. I think it's awesome. Card number seven, Stephen Delmo. Oh, wow. We got some good ones in this. There's Tully Blanchard. 30 out of 35. One of the four horsemen. Last night we got Arn Anderson, number to five. And we had Ric Flair. And now we have Tully Blanchard, number to 35, purple. Let's go on to Steven Delmo. That is cool. He's still active in AEW as a manager or coach. Kind of like Arn Anderson is. That's number seven. Number eight. Steven as well. And this is pretty cool. We got a great Muta. <laughs> Purple. Ten out of fifteen. It's like a clear cut. Ultimate clearly dominant. It's a see-through card. The Great Muda. Remember him? <laughs> That's awesome. That's a smaller one. I'll put that in a small sleeve. Regular size sleeve. And a regular top loader. Where are they? There they are. Awesome. That is so cool. 10 out of 15 purple. Clearly dominant. Great Muda. See, it's... There's the back of it. 
And then card number 789. This is the ninth one. That's Kyle Kelleher. Is going to get Sumi Sakai. Ultimate Stars. Orange. There you go. That's pretty cool. That's going to Kyle Kelleher. And then we go number 10. Is Steven Delmo. Who's got 11? Yeah, 10 is Steven. 11 is Pedro. And 12 is Steven again. So here is number 10. Perry Saturn. Remember him? Red. 2 out of 10. Wow. I remember him. Yeah, it's crazy that, that it would be awesome to do this as a full case break. So red Perry Saturn number to ten, and then we got a dual auto coming for Pedro. He got number eleven. Oh wow, we're gonna end it on a high note. Wow, <laughs> that's perfect. Taz and Funaki, ultimate signatures, orange parallel. That's going to Pedro. No card number eleven. That is cool. Some nice dual autos. Notice there wasn't one in the first box. So it was kind of all over the place after the first one. And it's not numbered, but still cool. And then the final card of the entire case, the 10th box we're ending on with Steven Delmo, is a clearly dominant blue parallel numbered 10 out of 10. Of Hulk Hogan. <laughs> there you go. What a way to end it. Hulk Hogan. Clearly dominant. Number to 10 blue parallel. Final card. Of 10 boxes. In a single case. That's the second Hogan autograph we got. We got a, him and Rodman on a dual auto once. But wow. A number to 10. Congratulations. There you go. Unreal. That's pretty cool looking. There's the back of it. Unreal. What a way to end it. Alright, so let's recap. Card one was Kamala Red, number 8 out of 10. Card two, Brutus Beefcake, orange. Card three was Cowboy Bob Orton, ultimate enshrined. Card four was the Barbarian, green, number to five. Card five was Ryan Shamrock, ring queens. That's an orange. And the sixth card was Brett the Hitman Heart, purple, numbered 5 out of 25. That's a sweet card there. That was the first box. Put that right there. Second box, card number 7 was Tully Blanchard, 30 out of 35, purple. Second card was the Great Muda, purple, clearly dominant, 10 out of 15. Ninth card, Sumi Sakai. I think she's in New Japan, am I right? New Japan Wrestling? She's not in AEW. I'm not sure. I'll have to look her up. Perry Saturn Red was the next one. Number 10. Number 10 out, uh, 2 out of 10. And we've got uh, Taz and Funaki, Ultimate Signatures Dual Auto. That's an orange parallel. That's card number 11. And then we ended with a blue, Ultimate Clearly Authentic, number 10 out of 10, Hulk Hogan autograph. That is sweet. There you go. Nice break. These cards are awesome. I'll see about getting another case. I'll find one. 
It won't take me long. You'll probably see another one popping up next week at some point. Just because they're just awesome. I mean, where are you going to get autographs like that? It's pretty cool. Did he sign it? Hulkster. He signed it. It looks like he did. There's a close-up of it. Yeah, I think he did. Hulkster. That is awesome. That is an awesome hit. <laughs> All right, cool. There you go. Look for more. I'll be getting more of this. I'll find it and get it in. And uh, yeah, it'll probably be mid midweek next week. You'll probably see it. I'll tag everybody with a heads up. All right, I appreciate it. Thank you. That was fun. I will be up a while if you want to message me with any questions or requests. I mean, if there's anything you want me to get, let me know, and I'll. I'll work on getting it. At the moment, I've got like 10 cases sitting here of all kinds of stuff. That Star Wars stuff that I have up, I put it up in the announcements. That stuff's pretty cool, too. There's a 40 autograph booklet in that that we're trying to find. I think that's our sixth case of it. And uh, it has all the actors' autographs throughout all of Star Wars. Like, it would be a huge money card. So, who knows? That might be in that case. We will see. But... Yeah, cool. I appreciate it again. Thank you very much. And have an awesome night. We will see you.